All right, this is what the mail girl just bought me um, from DigiKey. It's supposed to be two uh, metal chassis, two aluminum chassis. I don't know if I measured right, but there's supposed to be two two chassis in this fancy box. Every time you see a box, you say to yourself, "This looks fancy. I wonder how this opens." And then you 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 try to open it the way you think it opens, and it, it doesn't open that way. And uh, I'm being very going to be very careful. I don't want to scratch the aluminum. I'm very fanatical about stuff. But uh, I noticed on uh, YouTube there seems to be a big interest in dot matrix printers. They've been recommending the videos to me. And then uh, there's a guy that got uh, 250 views, 250,000 views. Uh, for uh, this thing, this is not going to work. I don't know. I, I measured, man. I measured this so many times. Uh, you know, you get older and you measure something. And uh, I could have swore it was six inches across. Not going to work. I don't want to make a box. I really don't want to make a box from scratch. It's five inches across. Okay, I know in my head it was supposed to be six inches. Uh, I could tell when I got the box out, outside that, and it's too, they're too light. These are too lightweight. What they've done over the years is they've, uh, they've made the, the metal thinner. Wow, what a difference. You know, everything, everything's going spirally, spiraling downward. And, uh, I could tell when I lifted the box up outside that uh, this one I measured wrong. Or I re they packed it good though. I give them that. It's not their fault. You know, it's hard to hard to. You know, they don't like they don't really specify all the time the gauge. And then when you're looking at something online, it's not like being in the store. And. Uh, I just does not want to come apart. It's just one of those deals where once you mess with saran wrap, this is probably my worst video. Yeah. I always met, I pick on people that unbox stuff because they don't know what's inside. But uh, I have a problem getting things apart because I try to be very careful that I don't scratch the product. And then like this saran wrap, it bundles up at the end. But man, this is so flimsy. Oh wow, what a difference. But maybe somewhere in the future. But I can tell you right now, that dimension I was ordering was six inches. Go we're an inch off. This thing, it, it, this transformer is just too heavy for this box. What a shame. I'm going to have to make a box. Oh, boy. What a disappointment. But that's how it is. And that's what Walter Cronkite used to say. And that's how it is. If I put it in this way, it almost feels like when I lift this, this, this transformer up, it's going to crush this box. Wow. The world has really changed since I was a... A younger man but we used to buy uh, bud boxes uh, but I could tell you where it was Lashins in Denville and Lashins in Denville has moved uh, they don't carry as many components as they used to even if I was in New Jersey uh, I'd have to go online for these boxes and uh, it looks like I'm gonna have to take my real heavy aluminum and make a, a box I did not want to do this. I got to go look at what I ordered. There is a receipt in there. It's going to say five inches. I read it wrong. Clicked it wrong. Getting old. Even when I ordered it, uh, it was saying uh, that I only ordered one. And then uh, on this one it says two. Five by nine.
So this is five inches long by 9.5 wide. See, in my mind, width by length. See, I do everything backwards from the real, the real world. Uh, comp reached unaffected July 21st. There's environmental things on aluminum boxes now. It's just getting worse and worse. Okay. I got to figure out what the hell I did wrong. Wow. Man, I remember when we used to get steel boxes. All right, that's it.